planetary siblings, not so fast. While it might be tempting to think of Venus and Earth as cosmic twins, the reality is far more complex and intriguing. From a distance, Venus and Earth might appear as planetary twins. Their similar size and mass make them seem like they could be siblings in the vast expanse of space. Indeed, they are quite similar in size and mass, almost like two peas in a cosmic pod. Both planets reside within our Sun's habitable zone, a region where conditions might be just right for life as we know it. This habitable zone is where temperatures are just right for liquid water to exist on a planet's surface. The possibility of liquid water is tantalizing because it is a key ingredient for life. Could Venus be another Earth? Could it harbor life? These questions have fascinated scientists and dreamers alike for generations. However, a closer look at Venus reveals a starkly different story, one that shatters the illusion of it being Earth's twin. Venus is far from being Earth's twin. Its surface is marked by volcanic activity and extreme conditions that are nothing like the relatively calm and nurturing environment of Earth. It is a hostile and unforgiving world with an atmosphere that is thick and turbulent, making it a far cry from the life-supporting conditions we enjoy on Earth. Venus's atmosphere is thick and toxic, composed mainly of carbon dioxide with clouds of sulfuric acid, creating a greenhouse effect that traps heat. This results in surface temperatures that are scorching hot, hot enough to melt lead, making the planet's surface a molten, inhospitable landscape. No evidence of life as we know it could survive on Venus. The conditions are simply too extreme and hostile for any known life forms to endure. The stark differences between these two planets offer valuable lessons for us. They remind us of the delicate balance of conditions needed for life to arise and thrive. These differences teach us about the fragility of our own planet's life-supporting conditions. They highlight how unique and precious Earth truly is in the grand scheme of the cosmos. The vibrant life and diverse ecosystems on Earth stand in stark contrast to the barren, hostile environment of Venus. This contrast underscores the uniqueness of our own planet Earth and the importance of preserving its delicate balance. As we continue to explore our solar system and beyond, let us remember the lessons Venus teaches us about the fragility and uniqueness of our home planet. Earth is not just another planet, it is a rare gem in the vast universe. So while Venus and Earth may look like siblings from afar, the reality is that Earth stands alone in its ability to support life as we know it. And that makes our planet truly special. The atmosphere of a planet plays a crucial role in shaping its environment. It determines the climate, weather patterns and even the potential for life. Without an atmosphere, a planet would be a barren, lifeless rock exposed to the harshness of space. Earth's atmosphere is a life-giving blanket of gases. It not only provides the air we breathe, but also regulates temperature, making Earth habitable. The atmosphere acts as a shield, protecting life from harmful solar radiation and cosmic rays. It is composed primarily of nitrogen and oxygen, with nitrogen making up about 78% and oxygen about 21%. This delicate balance is crucial for sustaining life as we know it. Trace gases like argon, carbon dioxide and water vapour also play significant roles in various atmospheric processes. This mixture is perfect for us to breathe. The oxygen supports cellular respiration, a process vital for energy production in living organisms. The atmosphere also supports the water cycle, which is essential for all forms of life. It also protects us from the sun's harmful radiation. The ozone layer, a part of the stratosphere, absorbs and scatters ultraviolet radiation, preventing it from reaching the surface. Additionally, Earth's magnetic field deflects charged particles from the solar wind, creating phenomena like the aurora borealis. Venus's atmosphere, in stark contrast, is a dense shroud of carbon dioxide. This thick, toxic atmosphere is inhospitable to life as we know it. The pressure on Venus's surface is about 92 times that of Earth's, equivalent to being 900 meters underwater on Earth. This thick atmosphere traps heat, leading to a runaway greenhouse effect. The surface temperature on Venus can reach up to 900 degrees Fahrenheit, hot enough to melt lead. This extreme heat is a result of the intense greenhouse effect caused by the high concentration of carbon dioxide. 
This is why Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system, even hotter than Mercury, which is closer to the Sun. The thick clouds of sulfuric acid in Venus's atmosphere reflect sunlight, but the heat that does penetrate is trapped, creating a hellish environment. Understanding these differences helps us appreciate the delicate balance that makes Earth a haven for life. Earth's surface is a diverse tapestry of oceans, continents and ice caps. From the vast blue oceans that cover over 70% of our planet to the sprawling continents that house a myriad of ecosystems, Earth's surface is a marvel of natural beauty and complexity. The polar ice caps, glistening white, stand as sentinels of our planet's climatic extremes. Temperatures are relatively stable, allowing for liquid water to exist in abundance. This stability is crucial for the sustenance of life as it provides a consistent environment where organisms can thrive. The presence of liquid water in oceans, lakes and rivers supports a diverse range of life forms from the tiniest plankton to the largest whales. This is the elixir of life. Water is essential for all known forms of life acting as a solvent, a means of transport and a participant in countless biochemical reactions. Without it, Life as we know it would not be possible. This liquid water makes our planet habitable. It nourishes the lush forests, sustains the diverse habitats, and provides a vital resource for all living creatures. From the smallest insects to the largest mammals, every organism relies on water for survival. Venus's surface is a desolate wasteland. Unlike Earth, Venus is a hostile environment where life as we know it cannot exist. The landscape is barren, rocky and shrouded in a thick, toxic atmosphere. The extreme temperatures, reaching over 900 degrees Fahrenheit, 475 degrees Celsius, are hot enough to melt lead. These scorching temperatures are a result of a runaway greenhouse effect, trapping heat and making the surface unbearably hot. The pressure at the surface is 90 times that of Earth's. This immense pressure is equivalent to being a mile beneath the ocean's surface, where the crushing force would be unbearable for any human or most machinery. It is like being a mile beneath the ocean's surface. The extreme conditions on Venus make it one of the most inhospitable places in our solar system, a stark contrast to the life-supporting environment of Earth. Earth's surface is constantly being reshaped by plate tectonics. These massive moving plates create mountains, valleys and ocean trenches. This geological activity is essential for regulating Earth's climate and recycling nutrients. Venus, on the other hand, appears to lack plate tectonics. Its surface is a volcanic landscape scarred by ancient eruptions. The lack of surface renewal contributes to the planet's extreme and unchanging climate. Section 5. The Blue Planet versus the dry desert. Water is the essence of life. Earth is blessed with abundant water, covering over 70% of its surface. This water is essential for all known life forms. It plays a vital role in regulating our planet's climate. Venus, despite its location in the habitable zone, is incredibly dry. Its scorching temperatures would cause any liquid water to evaporate instantly. The thick atmosphere would prevent it from escaping into space. Section 6. Earth's Magnetic Shield. Earth possesses a protective magnetic field generated by its molten iron core. This magnetic field acts as a shield, deflecting harmful solar wind and cosmic rays. This protection is crucial for life to thrive. Venus lacks a global magnetic field. This leaves its atmosphere vulnerable to being stripped away by the solar wind. This lack of protection further contributes to the planet's harsh and unforgiving environment. Section 7. Spinning through space. Earth rotates on its axis once every 24 hours, giving us our day and night cycle. This rotation is also responsible for our planet's stable climate and weather patterns. Venus rotates incredibly slowly and in the opposite direction to Earth. This retrograde rotation means that a day on Venus is longer than its year. The exact reasons for this unusual rotation remain a mystery to scientists. Section 8. Life's Cradle and a Barren World 
Earth is teeming with life from the smallest microorganisms to the largest whales. Our planet's diverse ecosystems are a testament to the remarkable resilience and adaptability of life. Venus, in contrast, is a sterile and lifeless world. Its extreme temperatures, toxic atmosphere and lack of liquid water make it impossible for life as we know it to exist. Section 9. Twins. More like distant cousins. While Venus and Earth may share some superficial similarities, their differences are vast and profound. Venus is a stark reminder that size and location are not enough to guarantee habitability. The extreme conditions on Venus serve as a valuable counterpoint to our own planet. They highlight the delicate balance of factors that make Earth so special. Section 10, Lessons from Our Celestial Neighbor. Studying Venus is crucial for understanding the evolution of planets and the conditions necessary for life. By comparing and contrasting Earth and Venus, we gain a deeper appreciation for the fragility of our own planet. As we continue to explore our solar system and beyond, the lessons learned from Venus will guide our search for life in the cosmos. They will help us appreciate the preciousness of our own pale blue dot, Earth. <laughs>